Jacksonville Center, clear track 530, level at 3000. Advise, clear track 530. Uh, Jack Center, Skyhawk, 61859, 5000. Jack Center, good afternoon, 848 Delta, 10000. Weather in Odom, Lake City Airport, Lake City Airport in sight. Oh, why Thank everyone is decided to talk? I'll uh, uh, try that later. Ok, so Mr. Loy, Gasly Ocon, on y croit, vraiment pas l'air d'avoir une grande connexion. Écoute, euh, ça va être euh, du côté de, de chez Alpine de gérer la situation. Euh, je pense que bon, ils arrivent en... Uh, Tampa, good morning, 521 Gold Sierra, with you in 10000. Ils arrivent en tant que euh, vainqueur de course donc, les deux, donc euh, ils ont le même statut, euh, voilà, après avoir durant la saison, mais c'est vrai qu'il y, y a des chances que ça se passe bien, il y a des chances que ça se passe moins bien. As you, McQueen, do you miss F1 Ah uh, non, I've, you know, I've done it for 10 years, it was amazing. I was so lucky to have that opportunity to do it. Uh, you know, only 20 guys in the world uh, doing 183, 10 podiums, that's... Uh, Pretty, uh, pretty special. So I don't miss it. I love IndyCar. I'm having a lot of fun. Hi, Josh here, Icon A Tampa, one one eight point five. Good day. Um, I'm having a lot of fun. So uh, really, um, so yeah, I uh, I, don't, I don't miss F1. I've had for did for ten years. Loved it, and uh, no, I'm really happy in IndyCar. Different uh, atmosphere. I can win every weekend. I go to the race, and uh, that's something I wanted to do. So, uh, Ringer, can I please be your guest at your next race? <laughs> I like it. Good attempt. Ah, uh, uh, it is definitely easier in. I don't need easy in F1, but. Uh, yeah. Um, can't. Sorry, I can't invite all of you guys. I can share as much as I can on Instagram and Twitter and YouTube, but uh, it'll be a bit tricky. To I invite a couple of millions of you at the race. Add it, should IndyCar have a race in Europe? Yes, I would love to have one race in Europe. Engine 1534, turn right, hitting 270. Right I would turn, love, 270, uh, to have one race in Europe. I would love to have one race in, uh, in Latin America. I'd love to have one race in Asia. Uh, I kind of miss uh, the traveling, so yeah, absolutely, yes. So your feeling was your head at champ, Derek Pool Nation. Well, the head, I think, is in the right place. Uh, the feeling are good. Um, Obviously, very happy with full position in in San. Fifteen thirty-four, Connect kind of Tampa, one one eight point eight. Good day. The race was a bit uh, more disappointed, but I think uh, the pace we show in the race and uh, and the pit stop and everything was so good that uh, we've a lot of um, we can be proud and, and ready to uh, to keep going and, and do well. Boy Gatto, when you're gonna start throwing hands? Uh, I don't exactly all know what throwing hands mean. If it's punching. I'm going to tell you something that I have never punched anyone in my life. I don't know to fight. I don't know to punch. Uh, so not soon yet. Um, yeah. Uh, there you go. Um, I, yeah, I don't know to I don't know fight. So uh, uh, maybe not a good idea to uh, try, right? Gary Paul Garrett, does the Florida heat and humidity help you? Ready to acclimate to long hot days behind the wheel of the track? I think so. I think so, Gary. I mean, uh, we could see some drivers really suffering last yeah, race. Yeah, 434, descend and maintain, 1, 1,000. Really suffering last race with the heat. Um, I was fine. I don't, I don't run the AC in the car. I don't run the cool suit. Uh, I don't like all of that. Uh, so, I think, uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, been used to the heat and the immediate and training every day, uh, uh, that, that, surely that must help quite a bit, so uh, yeah, I guess Approach so. United 430. I'm generally curious, does it bother you having number 20 instead of 8? Is it fine since 8 is exactly. it 8, or do you not really care? Uh, 28 is the second life of number 8, I think. Number 8 in Formula 1, the second life of number 8 in IndyCar. Um, I love 28, it's the big number for, you know, the team and ready. Yeah. 26, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, Kilo Alpha 8000. Oh, I like it. Uh, the Sways Express, what's your favorite sim racing game? Uh, favorite racing game will be R Factor 2. Uh, I just feel like it's probably the most representative one, the most, uh, yeah, real one. Uh, the community is a bit better on our racing, I'm, I'm, yes, but I like the car on, on R Factor 2. Uh, Justin, what for you, if you could create a racing team, what would be the team name be? RAG. I've got my racing, sim racing team, RAG Esports, so it would just be RAG Racing, right? I like it.
Uh, Cabanas, who do you see as the Martin in the next races? I see them well. I think they, they did really well. Um, quite impressed with uh, with what they've been doing in Bahrain. So if they can keep that up, if they can keep uh, developing the car, they should be in a good uh, in a good spot for sure. Uh, it's good to see Alonso up there. Uh, such a big driver. Very happy for that. Uh, Robinson, if you had to choose, would you rather have a Nova steering car or an under steering car? Every any day, over steering car. I cannot deal with under steering car. I was suffering with it last year in 2022, and 100% uh, uh, I go for the oversteering, which is uh, works well with my driving style. Uh, Souffton Stéphane, uh, salut Romain, dommage pour hier. Pourquoi avoir insisté sur l'extérieur? Pourquoi ne pas avoir entendu en restant dans ton rétro à gauche? Facile à dire en restant sur son canapé. Facile à dire en restant sur son canapé, c'est sûr. Uh, pourquoi j'ai insisté à gauche? Parce qu'il y avait plus de grippe, parce qu'il y avait des pneus chauds, parce que c'est un pit très difficile de doubler. Il était en pneus froids, moi j'étais en pneus chauds. C'était un petit peu mon occasion. Uh, et parce que s'il avait freiné à l'endroit où il devait freiner pour passer le virage, uh, j'étais devant au point de corde. Donc en fait, uh, uh, moi j'ai fait, j'étais bon pour le virage. Ça arrive, c'est comme ça, uh, c'est la course. Favorite IndyCar moment so far, uh, pole position in St. Pete. Update. Hey Caitlin Weaver, what plane am I flying? I'm flying a Baron G58, a uh, beautiful plane. I'm uh, having a lot of headwind right now, 22 knots of headwind. Uh, through a speed of uh, 193 knots, ground speed 172 knots. Um, yeah, nothing I can do about that. So just uh, tagging along and uh, hoping that I'm going to have a lot of uh, tailwind when I come back from Indianapolis. Uh, David Button, do you still want to drive F1? I believe you're at the same level as Alonso. You're becoming a better driver. <laughs> well, thanks, uh, David. Uh, David, I should say, uh, Fernando was my teammate in. Uh, 2009 and absolutely love uh, racing with him. Uh, uh, he could learn so much from Fernando. So that was great. It's probably one of the most talented drivers that I've raced with. And um, he's 42, but he, uh, or oh, 41. Anyway, he's uh, above 40, but drives like he was 20. I love that. I'm the same way. I, uh, I just keep pushing, keep driving, keep trying. And uh, the day I don't, uh, I don't try anymore, I'll stop. Dear the gentleman, uh, when you have an incident like yesterday with someone that you respect and have friendship with, do you feel differently about you once you're able to wind down, or are you still just as frustrated regarding the It wasn't for me. Um, I think, you know, for me, the most important about, yes, uh, St. Peter is that Scott came to apologize. We all make mistakes, I make mistakes. Uh, it's part of what we do. Uh, we always try 100%. We go for the And you know what? Uh, Elton said, I no longer for, I go for a gap that exists. You're no longer a racing driver. Elton was the best of the best of the best. And I go by that uh, philosophy. So Scott tried. I tried. Am I frustrated? Absolutely, yes. Was I? Was it my race? Yes. Was it the fastest out there? Yes. But you know what? I'll do it again next race. Everything is good. Everything is good on engine. We keep going. All right. Uh, the Pizza and US road car catching your attention. I think the new Lamborghini Aventador. Right, right. Delta contact Jacksonville Center 127.57. 127.57. 84 Delta. Okay, so uh, new Aventador. I was lucky to see it in uh, before everyone else. Uh, I mean, the Aventador is a beautiful car. Someone check on who is that? Uh, Matt, what is the LSP the velocity of an unladen swallow? I do not know what that means. So, my airspeed velocity on the plane right now is 196 knots. Uh, Seth, have you had any barbecue in Austin when racing at Kota? Of course, of course I have. And uh, I love barbecuing. Um, saying that, I think North Carolina, the barbecue, I prefer it to Texas by just a little bit. But I really enjoyed it when I was there. And um, yeah, having barbecue is, is the, really the best. Martin Murtag, what IndyCar trucks would you like to see on a modern F1 car run and what also what F1 circuit would to test in an IndyCar? So, uh, I think the only track that would work for Formula 1 in the US is Road America. It would be quite cool to see uh, a Formula 1 in Laguna Seca. I think the front wing wouldn't make it in the corner too. That would be pretty cool. Uh, and which track would you like to do in IndyCar? I think Monaco could be quite cool in an IndyCar. I think uh, Montreal could be quite cool in IndyCar. Uh, twisty, bumpy, small.
small circuit for it. Okay, this team stole. That's a good question. What can yeah, F1 learn? Yeah, okay. 355, back, checking in one. Can F1 learn from IndyCar? What can IndyCar learn from F1? I think F1 could learn from IndyCar the rule that if you create a red flag or a yellow flag in qualifying, you lose your two fastest lap time, which is very uh, hard but very cool. Uh, I think uh, IndyCar could uh, also learn some stuff from here. Formula One in and, and maybe uh, the way to market. You know, even though we're making uh, a lot of effort, one, um, one uh, just just bring it a little bit uh, more glamour, uh, I would say. Even though we're going the right direction with IndyCar, uh, what we had in St. Pete, so many fans, so many access to the fan, that was outstanding. And do I see staying 10 years in IndyCar? I mean, no, uh, eight other pop contact. okay, Elio won the 500 at uh, 46 years old, so I uh, still have my chance, right? Okay, so do you ever take good test drive the Mercedes? I remember you were logistics for having a race in the car when the test was supposed to happen. Ah, uh, yes, the test hasn't happened yet. The test is on. Every time I see Toto, is is uh, only one of Mercedes. They are like yes. Number four, two, two, Romeo. There's a very widely scattered. Need to make the test happen. Uh, but it's been a bit my fault. I haven't had really have had the time to. Uh, I haven't really have had the time yeah, to do it, so uh, yeah. Um, right between them and, uh, it will happen, but uh, for now I'm kind of busy trying to win races in the car. So, uh, Juan Lu Almesh Ashford, what is the best anecdote that has happened to you? Uh, hi from Spain. Hey, Spain, hola. Que tal? Uh, what's the best that has happened to you? I don't know, there were some really cool ones. Uh, I don't know, just uh, I love the fact that I was able to celebrate uh, with my kids in St. Pete. That was that was really cool. Um, hey, P1 Krunan, how much different similar is an IndyCar compared to F1 car? Uh, yeah, I made a video about uh, about IndyCar, the difference between IndyCar and uh, and Formula One. So you scroll down and find it, and uh, you should have all the answers that you're looking for. What's your mindset after the race in St. Peter? You talk about mental side on Netflix, or do you clear it? I've been cl so close to your first win. Oh, I don't know. I just. Uh we just accept what it is. Uh, there's not much we could have done differently, so we are on for the next race. Uh, should be good. And, uh, I'm positive. Uh, I'm actually yeah. picking up uh, one of our numbers, the old season. is... Uh, um, Ratatouille, do you prefer your smalls, Lighty Bird or Chad? I don't really like smalls. I like marshmallow, but I don't really like the small. Um, Will power make me try? Level 3 1 heavy, advise when you have the weather at Robbins instead of maintaining uh, power. I'm not a huge fan of it. Uh, Chris Mackey, if you could have been teammate with any F1 driver, dead or alive, who would be on the way? Uh, Nicky Lauda, Ayrton Senna, Juan Manuel Fangio, um, Anna Post. I would have been cool. Hey Jane, um, are you at least physically healed now from the dreadful accident? Yes, I am fully healed. That's my hand. I actually got a hit on Sunday on the craft uh, in the accident, but uh, just a bad bruise, uh, nothing else. So, all working nicely. It's my favorite meal to cook. I love barbecuing these days in Florida. It's so cool, but uh, I like to cook any salty stuff. Um, yeah. Il y a une chance de troisième en France sur un circuit européen cette année. Euh, non, pour le moment, pas de, pas de retour en Lyon, désolé. Euh, les Grands Prix avec Canal+. Pas de Grand Prix en France. Sorry for your recent results, especially when battling for the win. Are you still in contact with F1 teams? Would you ref a return if offered a seat? Ah, uh, yeah, if it's, uh, if it's a win, of course I would love to return. Uh, but, uh, Returning just to return, uh, no, I uh, I was lucky to do it for 10 years, but no, I want to win races. William, what's the race you're looking for the most this year? Um, I love I love St. Pete, I love Long Beach, I love Road America, uh, Indy 500, of course, so a lot of them, I guess. Uh, Boost 219 did driving in 2019 ass, and it's terrible to take help with your total life saving skill. You seem to be ahead of the game in St. Pete. Um, yeah, I think I'm good with that. I, it's something that I've good since 2012. I don't, oh, even before in the GP2, uh, 2000, uh, getting temperature. I could close that out. Uh, so, yeah, pretty good with start egg. Uh, kind of natural, but definitely working with the PLEs for many years uh, to understand that. It gives me a bit of a name. Uh, Matteo, how much do you think the same chassis for all the cars can make F1 back interesting? Uh, well, I think F1 has made a really good right direction obviously Red Bull has been dominating those last two years uh, but it is what it is uh, I think F1 shouldn't go standard uh, at least they should maybe on some parts but not necessarily on everything it's still Formula 1 and they, they have to develop their own stuff right 
Can I meet you at Indy? May absolutely, Barry. Come in front of the garage and we meet each other. Barry Hill, what was the trickiest spot of transitioning from road to oval about your first oval and you killed it? Uh, yeah, it's just that oval is very not natural for us, uh, European driver. The car doesn't want to go straight. 9 train 279, 4 miles from Allman, turn um, left heading 0. It is very different, but I think I did uh, I did pretty yeah, well. Uh, approach uh, Meridian 8755, X-ray. Uh, actually looking forward to, uh, to some more. Uh, ripping the top apart from winning a race, what I expected is expect. Yeah. I'd love to fight for the championship, that's what we're going to be doing, right? Harry Brown, do you love loving in Florida? You wish you had chosen a snap of Miami. I love both, I really love both cities, uh, but I feel really good in Miami. I've got a lot of friends down there. So I love Florida, it's a lot of fun, and uh, I'm very, very lucky to be living in such a, a great location. You said to talk after you visit, uh, after you come out, uh, it was a big F word. Uh, I just wanted to get it out of my chest and then talk to the medical team that uh, was superb and uh, came straight to me and checked me out. And, yeah, uh, I had to let some frustration out. King, what's your favorite Midwest town to visit and why? I love Chicago. Uh, I love Chicago. I think it's such a great city. I don't think I could live there. It's too big of a city for me and uh, a little bit too winter, but. Uh, I really, uh, I really love Chicago. Daniel Torres, first, are you flying? Second, are you not using the RV? 279, contact. I'm using, the, I'm using the, uh, the RV at every race, but I'm flying to every race as well. I'm flying to the meeting in India. Right now, flying. 9261, cross it. I wrote us 91. Can you expect your sandwich of the season ahead? You need pace. Right, the week. Yeah, I think the pace was very good. Uh, I'm not worried on street course. We've got a very strong baseline. I think on road course, we're going to have a very strong baseline as well on ovals. We can make some progress, but I'm excited to, uh, to see what we can do in Texas. Uh, Galanda, am I going to the race of champion in the future? I don't know. I won it in 2012, and uh, it would be fun to go back, but uh, I've been pretty November busy. 855. Grand would you ever consider trying a wing, wing 410 sprint car or dirt super late model? Or, yeah, I think I'm, I'm going to try some of that uh, for fun. It looks uh, it looks. Cool. The U.S. state you've been is your favorite. I love Wisconsin. It reminds me a little bit of Switzerland. I train two six one climb is. out instructions are oh, heading yeah, uh, just like big one way one. heading in three thousand. Le plan F1 team ça joue le titre cette année. Ben on espère bien. C'est le but. Ah, comment tu te sens pour le championnat cette année? Tu penses pour être champion? On va on va essayer. Hein? Ça va être le but. On va essayer. Pe grande che io credo che puoi vincere. Credo anche. Voglio fare questo. Jean-Marc Rotzert, why are you not flying a TBN 960? Uh, I'm actually Five looking at now and trying to explain. All right, guys, well, thank you everyone for all the good questions. Uh, that was fun. Uh, make me uh, let the travel go a little bit faster. I'm going to go and uh, choose what's the best answer for the win. See you in a bit.